So somewhere under all this snow is a turn lane. I don't think it matters quite where because there's no one up here. So we are going to turn into the Winoga Snow Park where uh, somewhere down at the bottom of the hill down that way is a van stuck at the bottom that can't get back out. So we're going to go get them and pull them back out of here. Go to the left over here. It's a little bit sloppy on the snow here. You can see why they're stuck. And then left turn again. There is a downhill right here that goes down to like a sledding hill in the summer it's where you can park and do mountain bike trails and all that but uh it's deceivingly steep it doesn't look that steep but when it's icy it's steep and uh, i guess there's a two-wheel drive van down here that just they can't leave so we're gonna help them leave and i see the flashing lights over there so that is probably them I'll turn off my light bar. Now you can see that the snow is indeed white and not neon yellow. In case you were wondering if I was living in like Mars or something. Oh, they're just stuck like right here, right here. It's us again. There you are. How's it going? It's terrible. <laughs> we just came out and we got stuck. Yeah, it's it's a, it's a little icy underneath. Deep here, yeah. It's all ice under. Yeah. It's just two-wheel drive okay well easy but on these there, there's nothing easy um, I'll come around in front and then uh, figure out what we're gonna hook to under there and okay just we had it going. we'll go all the way around and we had it going and it stopped I don't know if it just once it gets going it can keep going but I don't, I don't know is this one front or rear wheel drive the wheel the front wheels are the only ones that are spinning okay so it's front wheel drive yeah These are horrible because there's nothing to hook to. Totally terrible. So it's the control arms way back there and those suck. But um, yeah, it, it won't, it's not going to make it up the hill even if we get it moving here. So it oh, might you be mean going out, getting out of here. Yeah. A little bit of incline. Pretty good incline. Yeah. So, and it, and it looks just like this where it's yeah. deep. So, um, I'll pull out in front and just, we'll just hook up the rope right here okay. and then uh, go from here. Okay. I'll drag you up. Yep. It's deeper than it looks out there. And uh, no hook points on the van at all. So that sucks. Make sure we got no knots, which we nope, all good. Okay, so you hop in and uh, you're just going to be in neutral. Okay. You just neutral and steer, and I'll pull you all the way to the top, and we'll go all the way out to the highway. to the highway there. Okay. Uh, okay. Right. Thank you. All right.
Good driving. Hey, how are you? <laughs> Good driving. You want to turn all the way this way yeah. so I can get to this one and then we'll do the same thing yeah. back to the other side. Set. Um, I will pull over here okay. and make sure you guys get going because you got that snow bank right there to get Bust through. through it. Yeah. Okay. And if not, since it's front wheel drive, I can go out of the back side and grab your back wheels with the wheel lift okay. and pick up and kind of okay. push you out if we have to. Okay. Go over here. Make sure they make it out. A little icy. I'll come around the back side and grab your back wheels with the wheel lift. And uh, you just set your parking brake, yeah. which will lock up your back wheels, and put it in neutral as far as the transmission. So, you want to hold this. Yeah. Reporting live. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> we were on a date night at Winoga Snow Park. <laughs> I'm Kim Leska. <laughs> Reporting live from bed. <laughs> Thank you, Casey. Thanks, Casey. All right. Thank you. That's a little different way of doing it, but <laughs> that, it works. That's amazing. Yeah. All right. Well, you guys are all set. Again. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Take care. Thank you. No problem. You guys have a good one. You too. Thank Be you. careful. It is slick on the way down. I would think. And they're off. Again. I pulled them out a up on Skyliner Road in a Jeep stuck in the snow with the track Jeep. I do gotta say, very, very nice people. And he loves him some shorts in the snow. Well, uh, that was a little bit different way of doing it, but um, use the income rope to pull him up the hill 
and uh, used a 30 foot uh, 7 8 rope as my pull rope and then used a short 7 8 rope I have as a, to make a bridle out of. That way the bridle is also kinetic and uh, absorbs any shock loads or anything like that. But she, she did a great job driving. She didn't no back and forth or slack and banging nothing, just nice and smooth. And then uh, th those tires just didn't have the traction to um, get back out on the highway. So use the auto loader on the back of this truck, pick up the back end scoop it out onto the road, set it down, and uh, off they go. So that's a, a different way of doing it, but it works. So uh, they're on the road headed home. I am doing the exact same thing. And uh, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed that little short recovery, and we will see you on the next one. There goes the snowplow.